first apologize for not making a video in five days. Um, but if you watched my last video, you know that I haven't because something's wrong with my camera. I think the SD card is corrupt or something like that. But any footage that I use from my camera, I can't import into iMovie. So I don't know what's going on. So, so this video is obviously by the title going to be about the Revlon Lip Butters. And there's been a lot of pandemonium on YouTube about these things because I know that a lot of people couldn't find them for a while and but they are going to be a permanent part of the Revlon collection so if you don't have your hands on them yet don't worry they will be in your store soon. So there's tons and tons of colors and I only picked up four because these are the four that appealed to me the most and they're kind of a little on the pricey side. Um, I picked mine up at CVS and I believe they were around eight dollars each so it's kind of a lot. Um, really quickly, I'll just run through the colors that I have, and then I'll talk to you more about them. So the first one is Red Velvet. It looks like this. This one is the most pigmented one, I believe. Um, definitely the most pigmented out of the four that I have. It is just a nice, super gorgeous, like, dark red. And all of these names are, like, confectionery kind of names. Like, you'll see that one was Red Velvet. This one is Lollipop. This one's gorgeous, too. This is just, like, a lovely magenta color. This one is my favorite. This one is super pigmented as well. As you can see, it's just a nice fuchsia color. Packaging is really nice on these, too, but... All of Revlon's products are pretty packaged nicely, are packaged pretty nicely. This one is Strawberry Shortcake, and it's just a pink, so of course I had to grab it. It's coming up a little darker um, on camera, and it looks like that. And then last but not least is Cupcake, and I really love Cupcake. Um, I just wish it was a little more pigmented. This is also a pink, but it is more of like a kind of blue undertone pink if you can see that on the end so those are the only four that I picked up because like I said those were the only four that appealed to me and again I didn't want to go crazy on Revlon lip butters and I'm really glad that I didn't because I do not love these I do not 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 love these um for what it's worth like the color payoff is really really nice they do go on very smooth and kind of have like a nice little sheen to them but I find that they don't stay on your lips at all. Like, I find that they're mostly smeared off my lips within, like, 10 minutes of me putting them on. I don't notice that they help, like, restore my lips or anything like that. Like, whatever the little selling point was on the end cap that I saw. But it was saying, like, oh, 90% of women report smoother lips. Because I think that was the purpose because, you know, most lipsticks are pretty drying and these are supposed to be, like, super moisturizing. Um... They moisturize somewhat, but not, like, amazingly. So even though these look really pigmented on my hand, they're not really, like, full-blown lipsticks. They're more like a balm and a lipstick. Um, so they are kind of sheer, and your lip texture is different than your hand texture. When I apply them, I have to get, like, a good, like, you know, a couple of coats on there to get, like, the color payoff that I want on my lips. So that's another downside to them, but, um... I don't know, like, I just can't rave about them like everybody else does. I don't know, I thought that they were going to sing and dance, I guess, when I picked them up. I did pick up four, so I kind of went a little crazy. I probably could live with just two. Um, and the two that I would live with would be Cupcake and Lollipop, which are these two. I do really like Red Velvet, and I do love Strawberry Shortcake, but I, can I live without them? Absolutely. Um, so... Don't think that everyone, like, hyping them up. I mean, I'm pretty sure that there's tons of you that are going to leave me comments down below and be like, what? I love these. And that's great. Um, but I'm just saying I don't love, love, love them. That's why a lot of you have been like, oh, why aren't they in your favorites videos? Because they're not really, like, one of my favorites. I don't really reach for them that much. Um, and yeah, that's just what I wanted to say. Um, it's not, I'm not saying that they're horrible. I'm just not saying that they're super amazing as some of these videos are leading out to be. Um, but I was really excited when I got them. I was just not super excited after like a week. I was like, I guess I didn't really need these. But I just wanted to get, give you guys my opinion on the Revlon Lip Butters. Um, if I had to rate them, I guess I would give them like a 7 on a good day. But yeah, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, hopefully I'll be on a real camera. Um, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!